My name is Robert Walker, and I'm going to talk about the Conowango Club. We uh, have enjoyed a, uh, a long history of over 100 years. We originally started in uh, 1896, there were 12 gentlemen then, and they decided it was time for a, quote, gentleman's club in Warren. In 1905, the current building was erected, and in 1915, uh, we had our first fire. Actually, we had another fire 11 years ago in 2002. Uh, we had to rebuild again, uh, but we did. The club has grown and changed and evolved over the years to a very social club. It was really just four gentlemen in the beginning, but it's a family-oriented club now. So if you want to uh, bring your family down and go bowling after dinner, you're welcome to do so. Each year, uh, we have an annual meeting and a dinner with this meeting, and uh, it is formal. Tuxedos are not required, but it's very traditional. It goes back a long way. So the formal part of the, the Conowango Club is we've tried to maintain that uh, through the years, and it's been successful. It's just something we expect to happen. We enjoy that part. We call it heritage or legacy. Uh, there are, we have a lot of members who are in their third generation in the family. It's passed along. We have some members that have been members for 80 years because their father made them join when they were became of age. And now we have grandsons joining. The town is small enough, so when you go to the club, it's a friendly place. You know most of the people there. The conversation is very light. And that's why Warren is, it's a safe place to live. It's large enough so you have some opportunities. You don't have to be socially active with just three people. Uh, you can choose your friends, and that's important.